Santa Josefa Central Elementary School with SPED program. It presents Project Pakli, providing adequate knowledge for literacy. Project Pakli is the overall program that embodies the various reading programs of Santa Josefa Central Elementary School with SPED program. We envision a central school where students can read independently and develop the values and skills necessary to become excellent graduates, potential human resources, and responsible citizens in the community and country as well. As a school that is gradually evolving to the new normal of education and advancing the demands of the next generation of learners, the school and its community promises to provide quality instruction, opportunities, and experiences to all learners from kindergarten to grade 6, provide activities and learning opportunities that will help learners improve their reading abilities and potential, allowing them to become independent readers and learners. Provide upskilling futuristic opportunities for teachers, parents, community members, and other stakeholders. Develop and ensure the quality of contextualized supplementary reading materials that will provide learners with rich and culturally relevant learning experiences outside of the classroom via print, broadcast, and online channels. Maintain partnerships with stakeholders and acknowledge their ownership of the program. EGRA test results showed that during school year 2018 to 2019, 100 out of 133 pupils tested in grade 1 produced letter sounds as syllables, gave incorrect sounds, had difficulty in producing the correct letter sounds, and cannot produce the correct letter sounds at all. For grades 3 to 6, Phil Erie was conducted. Test results last school year 2018-2019 revealed that 112 pupils or 19% out of 588 pupils tested belong to frustration level in English. In Filipino, 111 or 15% out of 761 pupils from grades 3 to 6 belong to frustration level. On the following school year 2019-2020, Phil Airy showed that 77 or 14% out of 564 pupils in grades 4 to 6 belong to frustration level in English. For Filipino, 13 pupils or 6% out of 213 pupils tested from grades 3 to 6 belong to frustration level. Santa Josefa Central Elementary School with SPED program anchored the project PACLI to the following rules and theories with a sincere intention to make every child a reader. Debit Order Number 173 Series of 2019 Hamon Bawat Bata Bumabasa 3 Bs Initiative Project PACLI aims to Equip learners with reading skills to make them proficient and independent readers in their grade level. Capacitate parents and guardians to become effective reading buddies. Develop reading habit in the community. Promote a friendly class home reading environment in learners' home, community centers, and in stakeholders' residence. Develop and produce contextualized worksheets, learners' activity sheets, reading materials, and instructional materials like radio-based instructions, television-based instructions, and the like. Sustain the habitual use of mother tongue, Filipino, and English in schools and at homes. And strengthen information technology knowledge, skills, and attitude among teachers, parents, and learners to adjust immediately and effectively to the distance learning modality. By providing learning experiences and opportunities related to the 14 domains and competencies, we aim to make every learner a reader in MTBMLE, Filipino and English at his or her own level with the use of appropriate technology. With the use of appropriate technology and facilitation of teachers and parents, learners should be able to develop meanings and communicate them through spoken and written language that is innovative, acceptable, and grammatically correct. The key players of these programs are the following. Memorandum of agreements were signed with various organizations and individuals. The modalities for reading in this time of pandemic. We have the adapted learning modality suited to learners, which is the distance learning. Printed and digital with blend of TV radio based instruction. Another is the class home. It is the channel where video recorded reading activities have been posted for the teachers to see and check. 
kaban sa kaalan. Where books and supplementary reading materials deposited in the Puruk centers for the community and learners to use. The reading material shall be prepared by the teachers with the support of the school head. Key Stage 1, Kindergarten to 3 Projects Project Mapples Games Mastery in Producing Letter Sound Through Games It is a continuous improvement CI project that aims to develop pupils' skills in producing correct sounds of letters through strategic games. This project will further be enhanced when teachers will produce video recorded demonstration of these games that will later be distributed to pupils through USB, OTG, and TAB. Project RAW – Read and Write It is an enhancement and supplementary activity of Drop Everything and Read where pupils read one story every day. The story will be the springboard in writing the reflections, realizations, and opinions about the lessons they learn from the character, setting, situation, and events of the story. Project Kaban sa Kaalam It is a partnership project and reading intervention of the school, Barangay Poblacion, LGU, and the Municipal Environment and Natural Resources Office, and all Purok leaders. A refrigerator in every Puruk center that contains donated books and reading materials from residents. These will also be enhanced by encouraging every household to establish their own mini-library at home. Books and supplementary reading materials that are not fully used from the school library will be distributed among the households. In the implementation stage of Key Stage 2 Grades 4 to 6, Project Real Read, Listen, and Learn is a versatile activity where pupils are given to read orally in front of the class their chosen story either in English or Filipino while their classmates listen as they read. The storyteller then, after reading the story orally in his her big book, will ask three to five questions which the listeners will answer either in oral or written form. This will also be enhanced by encouraging pupils to video record their storytelling and questions to be posted in their group chats or in the class home Facebook page for the other pupils and parents to view. Meredith Project Raw, Read and Write, and Kaban sa Kaalam are also implemented in Key Stage 2. Another intervention activity is Verse of the Week, Vow where verses from the Bible or Quran will be shared by pupils through group chats, cell phone messages, and class home Facebook page. Then, the teacher will ask reflections and takeaways, either written or chat messages. This is part of the Edukasyong Pagpapakataw content development. Other intervention activity is reading using multimedia activities, RUMA, where reading activities are given to pupils to keep track of the progress of the reading projects, the school created a monitoring and evaluation timetable. The things that are needed to be done to effectively and efficiently implement the reading program in the school. As the gauge of the reading program result, the school reading profile will be consolidated and analyzed. This way, the data will tell if the intervention activities will have significant impact to the reading performance of the learners. The project evaluation tool from the school-based management continuous improvement will be modified aligned to the reading program. The results will be part of the SBM repository for future use and benchmarking. With the use of the criteria for the search for reading teachers, the praise committee will search and choose the school-based outstanding reading teachers, those stakeholders with exceptional contribution towards our reading program implementation. Thus, the best reading body parents will be identified. The exceptional learner's reading performance will also be highlighted and awarded during the reading festival. The reading program is an evolving program that needs to be revisited from time to time, not just by coordinator or school head or the team, but the whole community as program owners. Because reading is everybody's concern. Pakli, providing adequate knowledge and literacy. A school reading program of Santa Josefa Central Elementary School with SPED program had been thoroughly and collaboratively conceptualized and formulated guided by the data-driven and experiential principles. As key players of this program, 
we affix our signatures, bearing with it the commitment to collaboratively implement and continuously improve the projects and activities. Pakli sa maalamon o malahot tayong kaugmaon.